Everybody. happy Thursday it's pretty early in the morning and it is a very gloomy day sorry about the lighting it's a little orange from my lights in here I am really hoping that it's not gonna be a gloomy day today because I love a good sunny day so welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a get back into a healthy routine with me I have not been having the healthiest routine especially with the foods I eat and how often I work out so I'm really trying to get back into that. So I thought I'd bring you guys along and kind of kickstart this. I don't want to call it a journey, but more of these like healthier habits in my life. Don't get me wrong. I love sweets. I'm not saying those are coming out of my diet by any means, but I do want to stop my like snacking and the amount of sweets I eat. Like literally, I'm not even kidding. Yesterday I ate an entire bag of those like peeled Twizzlers and those are the kind of things I just need to stop. So I'm gonna bring you guys along and kind of bring you through my steps to like just having an overall healthier lifestyle. I'm not trying to diet or anything like that. So I'm gonna start off the morning with going to Orange Theory and getting a really good workout in. But before I go, I wanna to talk to you guys about today's sponsor, which is Hilma. I'm so thankful to be working with them. So Hilma has all of your digestive essentials. And what I love is that their remedies are made from natural ingredients and they're clean label project certified, which just means that they're non-toxic and they're made without any dyes, fillers, or artificial sweet. My period came yesterday and she came strong. I definitely felt it. I've been feeling really, really bloated. So what I'm reaching for today is my gas and bloat relief. And what I love is that this works in the moment and it's a natural alternative to any OTC product. What I love about Hilma is that they use natural ingredients that I am familiar with and that are clinically proven to help in these certain areas. So for example, in the gas and bloat relief, it's made with fennel, peppermint leaf, lemon balm, caraway, and anise. So these are all things that I'm very familiar with, which makes me feel really comfortable and specifically they use peppermint leaf because it's clinically proven to help with bloating. So Hillman has other remedies that are great like their upset stomach relief or their stomach reset. It helps rebalance and rehydrate your gut. The upset stomach relief is a great remedy for clearly an upset stomach or heartburn but without all the side effects. So those are all the reasons that I love Hilma. Not only that they're natural but they actually work which is like the most important thing. So I'm going to take these this morning to really help with my bloating and this is what I go to on my period um, I've been pleasantly surprised with the results it really does work so if you guys want to check out Hilma you can use my link in the description box or use the code JacquelineBrook20 this will get you 20% off any of your Hilma products so I'm gonna take the gas and bloat relief and then head off to Orange Theory and I'll catch up with you guys after theory and wow that was a workout I can feel that I'm dehydrated so that's gonna be my goal today is to drink a lot of water um, I even forgot to bring my water bottle into orange theory so here's my goal for the day today I do not want to snack I snack all the time I don't want to snack on any candy or anything and I want to eat overall well balanced meals so I think for lunch I'm gonna go to pliables which is like a smoothie bowl place um, but they're huge like they're really really big and they fill me up I don't know how good it is for you but I'm eating fruit so I feel like it's good and I also am gonna take a walk in the afternoon so you guys probably remember if you've watched my vlogs for the past couple of months but I would go on like 
three, four mile walks every single day, um, but I've stopped doing that and I wanna get back into it. And I can sense that in the winter, I'm never gonna wanna do that because it's gonna be so cold. So I wanna soak it up while I can. I plan on going on a walk later. So I'm gonna hydrate, I'm gonna shower, and I'm gonna get some work done. Please ignore the laundry going in the dryer, but I am getting hungry. It's 12 o'clock, so I think I'm going to go to Pliables, and I think I'm going to take a walk around that area. I really enjoy taking walks, and normally I would do it with Sam, but he's in the office. I don't think I mentioned that, but Sam is in the office today, so I can't decide if I should grab groceries while I'm out now, or I will be going back out again at 3. I've gotten an appointment. It's about 30 minutes away, so I've got to leave here at like 2.30, so I really need to get going. I think I'll save the grocery store for after that, and tonight we've got small groups, so I have no clue what we're having for dinner. So I'm going to head over to the smoothie bowl place, get a smoothie bowl, walk around. I made a Story. He took out a notepad If you're wondering what I get, this is a strawberry, banana, and coconut milk base with banana strawberries on top, Nutella and peanut butter, and then some cacao nibs, I think is how you say it, and granola. And it is so good. And I watched him disappear like smoke. And I I'm back. I that walk was so nice and much needed. I got to catch up with my cousin Abigail. It's currently 1 o'clock, so I'm going to do some work until my appointment. So I'm hoping to get all my work done for the day. That way I can get some other things done off of my to-do list, like cleaning the house. Hello friends, it's been a bit. It is now five o'clock and I just got back from my appointment. It took forever because I was in traffic for literally an hour. Now I'm gonna sit down and catch up on this book for my small group tonight. I am a little bit behind in my reading, so I'm just gonna sit here and read and sip on this tea that I just made that I'm gonna show you guys how I make it tomorrow. It is my copycat version of the Starbucks Honey Citrus Mint Tea. It's just the perfect time for it. So I'm gonna sit here and read and just enjoy my time I'm alone as I wait for Sam to get home and for us to head to small group. So it is now Friday and I am dressed and ready to go off to Orange Theory. I have it back to back, which I try not to do, but I couldn't make it any other day this week and I get two classes a week. I gotta go, I'm gonna be late, so let's head out. I'm back from Orange Theory and that really kicked my butt, my arms especially. 
You guys could probably see my hands shaking with the weights. It hurts so bad. Today I'm going to continue editing and I would really like to clean. Hopefully I can get to that. Um, and then I want to show you guys how I make that like copycat Starbucks recipe because it's so good for the honey citrus mint tea. I had it yesterday and I can't wait to have it again today. So I'm going to shower, get ready and get to work. bit later I have been working literally non-stop and it's already 1 45 so Sam made lunch today his, as I do his specialty that he makes which is fried rice I am so hungry thank you wow that's 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 hot yep he even cubed the chicken I cubed the chick it smells good it smells like legit in my last video that I just posted the like days in my life. I said in there that I feel like Sam's comments wouldn't land. Or that your sarcastic no! comments wouldn't land. Is it not land? I feel like I'm being roasted in the comments Should by all of you guys. Oh guys! They land. Yeah. We're Christians. I'm literally crying. Oh my. This is so good. Where is Leave Sam him is, in. Sam is hilarious. Leave him in. Haha. Ha. Sam's sarcastic comments do land. LOL. Sam's <laughs> sarcastic comments. Yes. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have told him. When I tell you I spat out my water laughing at Sam's we're Christian comment. Okay, people. I hear you. I love Sam. He's so funny. Well, I'm taken, but thank you. Also, I just gotta say, I found a Spindrift flavor that I like, and it's lemon. Who would have thought, because I don't like lemon water. Like, don't put anything in my water. Just give me plain water, specifically with no ice. But this is pretty good. Okay, guys, it has been a little bit since I've talked to you. I've just been working, nothing super interesting. But with it getting cold outside and it being this time of year, this is normally when I would reach for the hot chocolate, the whipped cream, things like that, that are very, not very good for you. Um, but that's why I've been loving this copycat at home honey citrus mint tea from Starbucks. So I want to show you guys how I make it. It's nothing crazy. You can buy all these ingredients at the store normally, and it's really nothing like I've cracked the code or anything like that. It's very straightforward. So the things that you'll need is some lemonade. You will need the Tivana Jade Citrus Mint Tea and the Tivana Peach Tranquility Tea. And then you're going to need honey, and then some optional things are extra lemon juice and sugar. So for the kind of lemonade that you get, it's really up to you. I right now just have this light lemonade. Very honestly, it's not very good but that's to me because I do not like the taste of like fake sweeteners like stevia well they're not fake but they're like alternatives to sugar which I know is what makes it better for you it's what makes it light but I do not like the taste so today I'm gonna make my own lemonade we'll see how it goes but I'm just gonna try it out but yeah use any kind of lemonade and what Starbucks does is that they actually froth their lemonade so you're gonna need a frother and you're just gonna pour a little bit in so the ratio is 50 50 50% 50 hot water 50% frothed lemonade so you're gonna heat up your water and your lemonade while that's heating up you can put one of each tea bag the jade citrus mint and the peach tranquility into your mug and then pour both of the liquids over it so pour over the water and the hot lemonade onto it and then and the last thing you add is a little bit of honey. It's totally up to you how much you put in there. And just like that, you have your honey citrus mint tea. It's so, so yummy. I did try to make my own lemonade, so we'll see how it goes. I haven't tried it yet because it's really hot, but I literally just used lemon juice, water, and a little bit of sugar. So now I think I'm gonna spend the rest of the night really tidying up our place. I've got so much laundry that I need to fold and do. You can see our drying rack is just sitting right there staring at me and waiting for me. So I'm gonna sip on my tea, kind of clean up, and it's just gonna be a relaxing night. We don't know what we're gonna do for dinner yet. Take me on 
on your treasure day. I did a lot of cleaning. I still have a few more things to do, like the laundry, but it's dinner time, so we're gonna go take a long walk to the grocery store. It's a little cold, which is why we're kind of bundled up. And Sam's gonna get a frozen pizza. Well, I'm gonna buy it frozen, but it, I'm not gonna eat it frozen. I think I'm gonna get sushi, maybe. I don't know. What was I gonna say? Probably nothing important. No, hold on, <laughs> hold on. I need you to get out of the room because I'm about to tell the camera what I think you're gonna buy when we're there, that you can't help yourself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and we're gonna see if we're right. Oh, so Jacqueline's gone. I think she's going to buy some sort of a chip. And I think it's gonna be like spicy Cheetos or popcorn. We don't have skinny pop. It's been a while. Oh, that's good. I'm afraid I'm What gonna do you think cold. I said? I think you said hot Cheetos. <laughs> And it got me thinking, and it got me thinking, wait, do I want hot Cheetos? And I'm like, I'm trying to be healthier. And I just say, I thought somebody was coming. That out. I didn't say that. We'll find or out. I've got nothing to lose after years with the blues. Oh, you know, you know. Twelve hours later. <laughs> All right. Why are you looking again? We're done. You got it. The shades of blue holds feather wings and arms made out of golden strings. I give anything, anything to say hello. 